I want to start off by saying uh, it's a little tense out here right now, it appears to be. We think we may have seen someone uh, w escorted by police just a moment ago. Um, we are working to learn more information about that. I just want to say that off the top here. But I spoke to the young man who was arrested at Monday night's protest and was released from jail today. He was at today's protest and his emotions were running high, but he told me he believes he's been targeted by police for his prominent role in these protests. And this was the sixth day of peaceful protests police released a video saying they're looking for help to identify a suspect in the alleged incident where Colbert Wilson was arrested. Police say a group acted outside the peaceful protesters and attacked a car on Monday. The video shows a group surrounding a car and police identify a man they believe to be a suspect. Now, the video does not show his face. The video also does not show an assault. We spoke to Wilson's attorney in the crowd tonight. He said he's still looking to learn more information about this case, but he's asking people to please not judge this young man at this point. I just think that I think that a lot of times in our community we jump to assumptions um, and we judge people based off how they're reacting in public, but we don't understand the pain that they're suffering and why they're reacting the way they are. Uh, this young man's been through a lot. Um, he feels like he's been targeted by the police for quite some time, and we'll get to the bottom of it. I just appreciate everyone's you know confidence that we can work the case out in court. At this point, it is unclear if there is video of the alleged assault. Colbert told me that he plans to make sure Lexington protests continue to be peaceful. 